all if. Mm -hmm. 753. Now we're looking at uh, who it is that uh, supports the courts and who doesn't. Because when you decide to turn the electricity off on me in the middle of winter, <coughs> you keep all my personal items. You send a text message to me that if I contact you, you're going to contact the authorities and have them arrest me. Yeah. <laughs> and then the court kept sending court notices from the government to a location that doesn't support the court. <coughs> I'm thinking there's a lawsuit in this. <laughs> Now, these ports, yes, I emailed them an actual copy of the fraudulent court order where there's forgery. Yes, there's fraud. Excuse me. And I thought that when they don't support and defend the Constitution of the United States, I had the legal right to sue for the ownership of the ports of the United States. Pooch! Now, what gave me that idea, yes, was that quite a while ago, mm-hmm, mm-hmm, there was somebody from the Middle East that wanted to buy the ports because of the, well, it's the income that they derive from shipping and receiving. Yes. Uh-huh. And since the ports do support the government of the individual counties, right, and they are obligated to support and defend the Constitution. Yes. Any knowledge right now? Now, I'm going to sue you for the Port of Port Angeles, okay? Uh -huh. Because I did email the port. I informed them that my sons were taken from me without any due process. Yes. And they were obligated. Mm -hmm. Now, uh, it's very easy for the county assessor's office to know what properties in the county are exempt from property taxes. <laughs> they don't get notice of any property taxes due. Yes. Yes, yes. Now, I was watching that Washington State television about Spokane City and Spokane County. Yes, it seemed that some senior citizens said, well, we paid our fair share of property taxes and <laughs> our kids don't go to school anymore, so we should be exempt from paying taxes. <laughs> the problem is taxation doesn't just go to school districts now. <laughs> A percentage of it goes to the support of the individual governments that receive that support for the employees and the infrastructure. Yes. Now, why don't you get me all the low-income signed statements of every individual that because of that class of persons, all the low-income, it's an undue hardship on their finances to pay property tax. Mm -hmm. This bullshit about being a senior. Yeah, I'm sorry. You could get sued as a senior citizen up to the age of your death. Yes. In fact, the day before you die. Okay. <laughs> and then the use of the actual courts is supported from the property taxes of those that pay. <laughs> now, I don't know if the Washington State Supreme Court had looked at it as I'm looking at it today. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But this bullshit about you being too old to have to pay property tax. Yeah. <laughs> Well, you still use the government services, and the government services include the court system. Yeah, they do. So maybe you'd like to get a lawsuit today, Spokane. Pouch! Now, I am uh, an actual graduate. I received a diploma from Lewis and Clark High School. Yes. And this dumb fucking bullshit right now. Mm -hmm. That senior citizens do not use the court system. Mm -hmm. We don't have to support district and half of the actual income of superior court judges. That's right. That's right. That's right. Exactly. Who do you think's going to probate your fucking estate, you old piece of shit? <laughs>